excited? Yeah. Hallelujah. Give glory to God. Hallelujah. First, we want to start by giving glory to God. We want to thank him for all he has done for us. Can everybody please stand and pray with me? Father, we just thank you, God. We worship your holy name. We lift your name up on high. You alone deserve all the glory and all the honor and all the praise. We thank you, Jesus. We call you Jehovah Nisi, Jehovah Rapha, oh God, our mighty God. We praise your holy name. We lift you up on high. We worship you, Jesus. You alone deserve all the glory and all the honor. We worship you, Jesus. We give you all the praise and all the all the adoration, oh God. Take all your glory. Take all your honor. You alone deserve it, oh God. There is no one besides you. No one besides you, oh God. We lift you up on high, oh God. We join with the angels and say, holy, holy, holy is our Lord God Almighty. We worship you, Jesus. We give you all the power and all the honor and all the glory, oh God. We call you El Shaddai, Elohim, oh God. We thank you, Jesus. El Elyon, oh God, the Most High. Our God strong and mighty in battle. We worship you, Jesus. We give you all the glory and all the honor. Our Abba Father, we praise you. We give you all the glory and honor. Oh God, take all the glory. Take all the honor. You alone deserve it. We worship you, Jesus. We exalt your name up on high. We worship you, Jesus. You alone deserve it, so take it all. Lift his holy name up. We worship you, Jesus. You alone deserve it. You alone deserve it. We can say nothing but thank you. Thank you for the roof over our heads. Thank you for the cards you give us. Thank you for the breath of life. Thank you for waking us up even this morning. Thank you for waking us, God. Thank you for helping us go to sleep peacefully. Thank you for helping us walk on this earth. Thank you for the bones in our flesh. Thank you for the shoes we wear on our feet. Thank you for our hair, God. Thank you for our faith, God. Thank you for everything you have given to us, oh God. We give you nothing but glory and honor. Take all the praise. Take all the glory. We worship you, Jesus. You alone deserve it, oh God. We worship you. We give you honor and all the glory, oh God. Pray, praise his holy name. Praise his holy name. Lift his name up, oh God. Our ancients of days, the most high God, we worship you. God of Abraham, God of Isaac, we lift your name up on high. You alone deserve it, our only faithful and true God. We worship you, God. Our God strong in battle. Our God, our God mighty in power, oh God. We worship you, God. The changer of everything, our may our way maker, oh God. We thank you, Jesus. You alone deserve it. We glorify your holy name. We lift your name up on high, oh God. You alone deserve all the glory and all the honor. We, you alone deserve all the glory and all the honor. We praise your holy name. We lift your name up on high. Lift it up, lift it up. Praise our God. Praise our God for all he has done for us in our lives. Praise him for all he has done from the food you eat to the table you sit at to eat, oh God. We thank you, Jesus. We thank you, Jesus. We thank you. We thank you for the son you have given to us the son you have given to shed his blood for us, oh God. We don't deserve it, but we just say thank you. We thank you for all you have done, oh God. We thank you. We thank you. All we can say is thank you. We lift your name upon high. We lift your name upon high. Next, we ask, we ask that God we ask that he helps us, help us with our country, with our finances, with our work, with anything you need help in. Psalm 46 verse 1 says, God is our refuge and strength and ever-present help in trouble. So do not fear, for I am with you. Do not be dismayed, for I am your God. I will strengthen you and help you. I will uphold you with my righteous hand in Isaiah 41 verse 10. God, thank you. We ask for help, oh God. Help with our finances, with our troubles, anything we need help in, oh God. Help us. Help us, God. We need help. Help us, God. We ask for, we thank, we thank you, Jesus. We just ask that you help us, oh God. Help us with anything we need, oh God. Heal us, oh God. Help us with our health, oh God. Increase us, oh God. We ask that you increase us, oh God. We pray for the children of Sacramento. We pray for the children of Nations Life Chapel. Lord, keep us all. We pray that you come and we know you, oh God. We pray that we are saved. We pray that we all the children know you, oh God. We ask for your help, oh God. Help us. Help us with our walk. Help us with our walk in faith, oh God. Help us with our journey to meet you, God. 
We need you, oh God. We need you. We call on to you, oh God. We call on to you, oh God. We call on to you, oh God. Help us be our refuge, oh God, our Savior, our God mighty in battle, oh God. We thank you, Jesus. Be our refuge, be our help, our Savior. We need you, God. We call on to your holy name. We ask for help, God. We ask for help, God. We pray for this city that the name of the Lord will be known. Let the name of the Lord be known in the city, oh God. Let us know you. Let us love you, oh God. Save this city from save this city from destructive habits. Thank, save this city, oh God. Save it. Save this city, oh God. Help us. Let us know you. Let us know you more and more. Our, our one and only God, our Jehovah. Lord, we lift your name upon high. Let us know you, oh God. We worship you. We glorify your holy name. We lift your name upon high, oh God. You alone deserve all the glory and all the honor. We lift your holy name. We worship you, Jesus. We worship you, God. Now we're going to ask for mercies. In Ephesians 1 verse 7, it says, In him we have redemption through his blood, the forgiveness of our trespasses according to the riches of his grace, our forgiving God. God, we ask that you forgive us. Forgive us for all our sins, O oh God. Anything we have committed, O oh God. We're not perfect, O oh God, but forgive us, O oh God. We do not deserve We do not deserve what you give to us, but we just ask for forgiveness. We ask for mercy, O oh God. We lift your name upon high, O oh God. We just ask for mercy. We ask for mercy, O oh God. Have mercy upon us, O oh God. Have mercy upon us, O oh God. Have mercy upon us, O God. In 1 John verse 1, verse 9, it says, If we confess our sins, he is faithful just to forgive us our sins and to cleanse us from all unrighteousness, O God. Clean our hearts, O God. Cleanse us from all unrighteousness, God. We ask for, we ask for you to cleanse, our, cleanse us, O God. Hallelujah. We praise your holy name. We pray for the nations. We want the gospel to be preached in every nation to every person, oh God. Let the gospel be preached, oh God. God, we stand in the gap for our generation. We stand in the gap for our generation. Lord, let your name, let us know you, oh God. Let your name be scattered upon the nations, upon our generation. Let us know you, oh God. We just want to know you more and more, oh God to understand you, O oh God, to understand your word, to understand what you have done for us, O oh God. We thank you, Jesus. We can't say nothing but thank you. We just thank you, O oh God. We thank you, God. We stand in the gap for our generation. Next, we want to, we just thank you for answered prayer, O oh God. We thank you for answered prayer. We, we pray that our prayer will be heard by you, O oh God. We just love you. We praise you. And we pray that our, our prayer will be heard, O oh God. We thank you so much for answered prayer. All we can say is thank you. We thank you, Jesus. We thank you, Jesus. We lift your name up on high. Hallelujah. 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 We bless your name, Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 Bible Amen. says, let everything that hath breath praise ye the Lord. Hallelujah. Amen. Come on, Hallelujah. somebody. Praise God in his Hallelujah. sanctuary. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise him. Praise him. Hallelujah. Come on, somebody. Can somebody help me with the pulpits? Hallelujah. Praise God in his sanctuary. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Come on, shout hallelujah. Amen. I don't hear you. I hear only the kids. So praise God in his sanctuary. Yeah. 
he reigns forever and ever. He reigns. Hallelujah. Yeah. Come on, let's do this. Bye. 
Yeshua, we magnify you this morning. You are God and you are God alone. You are my beloved and you are the most beautiful and there is no one like you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yeah. 
It's worthy to be praised. Praise His name. Bless His holy name. Lord. Begin to Praise lift up the name of the Lord. Just worship Him as Yeshua. Worship Him as the I Am that I Am. Worship Him as the Prince of Peace. Worship Him as Jehovah, the Sovereign King over your life. Come on and praise the name of the living God. Give him glory in the house. Hallelujah. Lord, we worship you this morning. You are Yeshua who's sovereign over all things. And Father, we are under you, O oh God. And Father, we walk with you as we stand in the gap for the generations. Hallelujah. As we stand in the gap for the generations. Hallelujah. As we stand in the gap for the generations. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Just wave those hands to the Lord in surrender to Him. We're going to take a few moments and we're going to stand in the gap for this generation that is standing before you. We're going to stand in the gap for your generation. Hallelujah. We're going to stand in the gap for the next generation. Hallelujah. We're going to speak to the nations this morning. We're going to declare the glory of the risen King. We're standing in the gap. Hallelujah.
begin to worship him. Say, Yahweh, you are our God. Yahweh, you are God of this generation. Yahweh, you are God of this house. Yahweh, you are God of this city. Yahweh, you are God even over the governments of this city. Say, Yahweh, you reign. Come on, lift up your voices. Lift up your voices and stand in the gap. Say, Yahweh, you reign. Yahweh, you are in control. Yahweh, you reign in our school systems. Yahweh, you reign in our children. Yahweh, you reign in this county. Hallelujah. Say, Yahweh, you reign. Hallelujah. Say, Yahweh, you reign. Hallelujah. Rain. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Welcome everybody to the house of the Lord. Amen. Amen. Are you excited? Yes. yes. Do we have any first time worshipers? Anybody worshiping for the first time? Can you raise your hand, please? The ushers at the back have an amen. Hallelujah. Amen. amen. Come on, let's give them a hand, church. Nation's Life Chapel. Hallelujah. That's not how we do it. Come on, come on. Yeah. shall be given back. You shall be given back more, overflowing. 
Amen. Amen. Honor the Lord with your wealth, with the first fruits of all your crops. Then your barns will be filled to overflowing, and your vats will brim over with new wine. Amen. 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 So everybody's supposed to have a flag on their chair. We're gonna, you, gonna, you guys are going to participate in this song. It's called Ebenezer. The flag should be on your seats or it should be passed around to you. Please, everybody, rise up as we sing Ebenezer. May the ushers please come forward. Somebody say, hey, 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 hey. I can only hear the kids. Somebody said, hey, 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 hey.
offering. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, we pray that as we have given to you, that you give back to us even more. God, we thank you for all you have given to us. We thank you for the fruit that you have given to us to plant a seed into your kingdom, oh God. We thank you, and we ask that you help us. We ask that you help us with our finances, oh God. And I pray, I pray that you help the people that weren't able to get today. May they come back, and may they have more mm -hmm. and exceeding, exceeding money, oh God. We thank you, Jesus, for all you have done, oh God. We Amen. praise your holy name. In Jesus' mighty name, I pray. Amen. Amen. You may be seated in the house of the Lord, and you guys too may be seated. And I'd like to invite Miss Shelby Vanessa Anderson to come and give the announcements. Miss Shelby Anderson. Oh Hallelujah. <laughs> Can you get the pulpit microphone from Miss Kumba? This is our year of settlement. First Peter 5:10, but the God of all grace who hath called us unto his eternal glory by Christ after after ye have sacrificed a while, make you perfect, establish strength, settle you. This number has been declared our month of exceeding great joy. You have put more joy yes, in my heart yes. than they have when their grand wine abund in peace. I will, li I will both lie down and sleep. For you alone, O oh Lord, make me dwell in safety. Please make it a point to join us every Wednesday at 6.30 p.m. for our Word on Wednesdays. Bible study on Sunday morning worship. Service starts at 10 a.m. with Life in the Word Adult Sunday School class, followed by Praise and Worship at 10.30 a.m. Please make it a point to attend all service and events we have planned each month. Social media, you are encouraged to subscribe and follow us on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube. Remember to check in on your Facebook. Christmas carol service will take place on December 24th. Come prepared to celebrate the birth of our Lord Jesus Christ in style. Amen. Amen. Pastor Appreciation Sunday will be held next week, December 17th. Themed a pastor, a pastor after God's own heart. Amen. We'll be having four fasting four days fasting and prayer from December 27th to 30th. Even I will be fasting myself, so I would like to see the hand. I would like to see the hands on who will be fasting this month in the house. God that remembers Genesis 8 first. Let us come together corporate Corporately to cry out to God and usher in 2024 on a positive and a positive note. Amen. Amen. Crossover service will be held on December 31st, starting at 9 p.m. Come prepare to cross over with Jesus in style. Amen. A message from our lead pastor to the first time visitors. Thank you for fellowshipping with us at Nations Life Chapel. If you're looking for a family home church of love, where the word of God is preached and the power of the Holy Spirit is manifested, then I personally invite you to join this assembly of winners. We are overcomers in Christ. If anyone have questions, prayer requests, counseling needs, or want more information about the church, please see our lead pastor of the church after service. Hallelujah. Amen. Shelby is fasting. Then I, that means I must fast. Hallelujah. Amen. I am going to invite the, we are calling them the Nations Kids, Kids, Kids and Teens Choir for now. We have to find a nice name for them. But I'm going to invite all of you to come back. They have a very special song that they are going to sing this morning. They're going to speak to the nations. Amen. And if I can have somebody to come and help me move the pulpits. Hallelujah. Amen. 
They're going to speak to the nations. And as they are singing and speaking to the nations, I'm going to ask that those flags that you have, you will be interceding for whatever that nation is. And we do apologize. There's no name on that flag. So we have no clue what those nations you have are. But just know that you are interceding for a nation. So the children should also be having their flags with them. I'm not sure why you don't have them. Uh, nobody picked the Zambia flag. Hallelujah. <laughs> That's the only one I know. The USA, Zambia, Union Jack. I know the Ghana flag. All right. Thank you very much. Hallelujah. All right. They will be ready for you. Hallelujah. Um, I need the little people. Hello, little people. I need the little people. You have to sing this time. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. Come on. Naomi, take them. Take them over there to the front. Okay. Hallelujah. Caleb, are you ready? Hello.
Somebody shout hallelujah. Ah, the kids have done such Amen. a great job. Hallelujah. Amen. There is anointing in this house. The power of the Most High God is in this house. The presence of God is in this house. Hallelujah. I, hallelujah. Hallelujah. So the kids are going to go to change because they, there's a couple of dances before we hear the word today. So what I want to do as they are changing is to call attention to today's scripture, the theme for why we are standing here. It comes from Ezekiel chapter 22 verse 30. Hallelujah. If you've got your Bible with you, uh, please turn and open with me to Ezekiel the 22nd chapter and verse 30. The Bible says, and I sought for a man among them. That should make up the hedge and stand in the gap before me for the land that I should destroy it. But I found none. Let it not be said of this generation, of you, that God found nobody to pray for the nations. Amen. Oh, I'm talking to you all. Let it not be said that God did not find you to pray for the nations. Amen. Hallelujah, we are the generation that's passing on the next message to the next generation. Hallelujah. So the question that you have to ask yourself this morning is what message are you giving the next generation? See, when I was growing up, God was not an option. Church was not an option. Going to school every day was not an option. There were some things that I had to do and I was taught to do and I was taught to do them. You know, you could say without question, but I was given a reason why it was good, right? Now, if we fast forward to this generation, what are we seeing? I, Mom, I don't feel like going to church today. Oh, okay, you can stay home. I'll leave you behind. I just don't feel like going to school today. Especially when we had those Zoom classes, I could just turn off the camera and just not do school, right? Huh, and that's another thing. They're given these choices. While God gives us a choice, there is one thing he always tells us. He says, I put before you life and death a blessing and a cursing. And he says, choose life so that you and your descendants may live. So I want us to rise up and I want this generation to pray for the next generation. I want us to pray for these children that are here. If you hear the statistics of how many children are taking drugs in this county of Sacramento, you will cry. If you hear the statistics of infectious disease, even in this South Sacramento, the numbers are high. In fact, we have the highest HIV rates in the Sacramento County in this South Sacramento. So I want us to rise up. We are going to pray this morning as we are waiting for the kids to come forth. I, whether you've got a kid or not, I want you to pray. Because there is a generation of children that needs your voice. They need you to declare and to speak into their lives. They need you to speak positively. It says, I'm looking for a man. So just begin to lift up your voices and say, God, I am that person. I am that man. I am that woman that is going to stand in the gap for this generation and for the next generation. Lift up your voices. I don't hear you. Say, I am that person that is going to build a hedge around the children as I declare the word of the living God over their lives. I am that person that is going to speak and cry out for the hand of God to rest upon the children of Sacramento, the children that are yet unborn. Say, I am that woman. I am that man that is standing before you this morning, oh God. I am crying out for this generation, oh God. Those that are drug addicted. Father, we are praying for deliverance, oh God. Father, those that have gotten in themselves involved with wrong characters and wrong situations and wrong, wrong, um, wrong uh, communities and wrong fellowships. Lord, we are standing in the gap for each and every one of them. Father, we rise up in 
in the mighty name of Jesus to declare freedom and liberty over your people because your word says he who the son sets free is free indeed. Hallelujah. So we declare freedom and liberty. We declare the power of God over Sacramento County. We declare the power of God over Sacramento City. We declare the power of God over California. We declare the power of the living God over these United States of America. We declare the power of God over the nations. Lord, rain down your spirit, oh God, and breathe upon us, oh God. Just breathe your name upon us. We sang Yahweh, but Father, it's not just a song to us. Breathe your name upon us and deliver us, oh God. We are crying out this morning for your mercies, oh God. Your mercies that are from everlasting to everlasting. Your mercies, oh God. Have mercy upon Sacramento County. Have mercy upon the church, oh God. For Lord, whatever we have failed or not done, oh God, to pass the message on to the next generation. Have mercy upon us, oh God. Show us your mercy in this house, oh God. Show us your mercy in this county, oh God. Show us your mercy. Hallelujah. Somebody shout mercy. Hallelujah. Shout mercy. Shout have mercy upon us, oh God. Hallelujah. You may be seated. Are the, are the teens ready? Hallelujah. The first group that we're going to see is the teen class. And they have a song. The song that they're going to dance to says, Oh Naga. And Onaga means it's working. That means the living God, the word of the living God is at work in their lives. It's at work in this place. Everything that they're declaring for God, it's working. Hallelujah. Somebody shout, it's working. working. Shout again, it's working. working. Hallelujah. Yes. Pastor, we're ready for you. Onaga. Hey.
God. Whew, I don't have that energy. Wow. <laughs> Praise the name of the living God. Wow, it's working. Is the word working for you? Hallelujah. Is the word of the living God working for you? Oh, you can do better than that. You see that energy that was here? Is the word of the living God working for you? Ah, louder than that. You can't be loud. I can't be louder than you. Is the word of the living God working for you? Aha, uh -huh. that's what I was looking for. Praise the Lord. The next dance is from the nation's dance crew. Hallelujah. The nation's dance crew. And they're singing a song, Jehovah Jireh. Because God has been our provider throughout this year from January to today. And he is still providing for us. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. And this is the children's class. After these things, that God tested Abraham and said to him, Abraham, and he said, Here I am. Then he said, Take now your son, your only son Isaac, whom you love, and go to the land of Moriah and offer him there as a burnt offering on one of the mountains of which I shall tell you. And Abraham said to his young men, Stay here with the donkey. The lad and I will go yonder and worship, and we will come back to you.